Dude, you don't even know. The Montreal Canadiens are on the board right now. They have 75th overall, but I don't care about that pick. I don't care who they take at 75th overall. I'll make a video about that later. Right now, I want to talk about Lane Hudson because the Montreal Canadiens have, in my opinion, just drafted a player that I believe is one of the most underrated players in the entire gosh darn draft. Man, what a pick. 62nd overall is the number right here. This is the draft pick that Montreal got in the Brett Kulak trade, I believe it was. So there you go, Brett Kulak. Thank you so much for your sacrifice. It has brought very, very great happiness to the Montreal Canadiens organization and fans, a.k.a. me. But if you take a look at Lane Hudson and where he was supposed to go, he was ranked 47th by Elite Prospects, 31st by Future Considerations, 40th by Paul McKenzie, 40th by McKean's, 31st by Craig Button. So this is a guy that went a lot later than he probably should have. And the reason is he's 5'8". 159 pounds as a left-handed defenseman. And if you watch the video that we made, the Why I Want video about Lane Hudson, I was pretty much waxing poetic about how this guy could have been like a Quinn Hughes-esque sort of player because he's very small, but he is very shifty. He's very electric. That's the word they use in the broadcast. He's electric. And this is a player that put up a whole bunch of points. He was over a point per game with the NTDP. If I recall correctly, he's one of the highest scoring NTDP players for defensemen like ever, which is kind of wild when you really think about it. Like this guy had more points than like the Quinn Hughes's and the Adam Fox's and the Luke Hughes's, something like that. And he gets slipped all the way down to the second round because he's only 5'8". They said this on the broadcast too, but if Lane Hudson was like five inches taller, he would have been a top five pick guaranteed. This guy moves incredibly well. He is dynamic. He is electric offensively. He is so shifty and creative with the puck on his stick. He has one of the highest pure ceilings out of all the players in the NHL draft this year. And the Montreal Canadiens snagged him up 62nd overall. Thank you so much, Kent Hughes. Thank you so much, Brett Kulak, for getting everything done here for the Canadians and actually allowing them to get a player that I am already in love with. I was in love with him before this entire thing went down, but man, this player coming over to Montreal, I love it. Talk in the comments about your thoughts about Lane Hudson coming over to the team. I hope you enjoyed this video. I gotta make a video about Vincent Rohrer because he just came out as the 75th overall pick here now too. And bye.